So hey guys, apologies for the wet hair, but I just thought I'd announce something that is pretty cool. Uh, if you missed the last uh, video for Climb to Master, you would have missed the announcement. But basically, uh, Monday, uh, this Monday, which is the, what, 23rd, uh, there is an event happening on my Twitch stream at 5pm UK time. Again, give a little leeway if we're late or anything like that, but basically... Uh, many of you may know Riot is trying to pitch the game to new players and a good way of doing that is using content creators obviously and uh, yeah they've contacted a bunch of different content creators that don't do league content and they have matched non-league YouTubers with league YouTubers. I think they're only using well it's only me and Fi at the moment uh, but me and Fi are going to be playing with Minilad and Kallux on my stream. Uh, Fi will be streaming as well. If you want to check his stream out, he will be streaming on Facebook. Uh, but most of the promotion will be going to my Twitch stream. Uh, they've not really played much. Mini Lad really hasn't played like at all. Kallax apparently used to play. Uh, and yeah, we're going to just play for about two hours. So, you know, three or four games maybe. And uh, just have fun. Um, you know, show them the game. Show them you can have fun. Maybe show them a, a couple of advanced techniques. Like, I'll probably pull out my Lee Sin. Uh, Riot has given us accounts just for this event that has unlocked everything. So we can play any champion we want. But yeah, it's a, it's a pretty cool opportunity. Um, I'm looking forward to it. Again, I actually watch Mini Lad a little bit myself. And if you have no idea who they are, uh, Mini Lad has got about 5 million YouTube subscri uh, subscribers. Kallax has got about 2.5. Apparently, he's something involved with the Sidemen. I've, I've personally never heard of that, but apparently that, that's a big thing. Um, but no, be there. 5 p.m. UK time. Again, if you can't make it, that's fine. I will be obviously recording it. And I'm sure even like the second video of the day, if I'm quick enough, will most likely be one of the games uh, with Mini Lad and stuff. Like what I'm thinking of doing is just recording every game we play and then just determining what's better to do. Do I upload individual videos per game or do I kind of mash two games together for one video? Again, two diamond players playing on low level accounts. There probably is going to be some stomping involved, even if me and Fi don't really try hard. Uh, but yeah, again, the, the, the event is mainly for fun. If you are a regular viewer of mine, please be kind of, you know, nice and welcoming to any new people that may come and watch. Because uh, again, Minilad and Kalux are going to be sending their viewers to apparently my stream. And so is Riot. Um, so we're probably going to be bre breaking some uh, Twitch records for my myself uh, tomorrow. Um, and again, there have been some people saying, "Is it? am I very nervous? The answer is no, because this is in my own territory. I'm at home. The most nervous I ever have been in that type of capacity was when I went on the Twitch stage at an Insomnia event. I was live in front of a lot of people. Um, that was a bit different. Well, this one, I'm in my own territory. It's my own stream. I can listen to my music if I want to. Um, and it's just going to be a big stream. So yeah, hopefully I'll see you there. Uh, let me know in the comment section if you watch those two. And also let me know what champions you guys think is a good idea for me to play. Um... Because, yeah, it's, it's just for fun, really. So, anyway, I'll see you, hopefully, in tomorrow's stream. If not, you'll catch the videos another time. See ya. All right, welcome to the game, everybody. Another episode of Climb to Master. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, we return. We're playing Shen. We did blind pick, but they picked Gangplank into us. Um, hopefully, we'll have a good game. Uh, the person, this person banned Darius, and I, whenever you see a Darius ban, you instantly, or in my head, go, um, Trindamir player. Again, I've been banning Trindamir quite recently, or a lot recently. Um, so, aha. Get rid of the box. That might have been a mistake. Hey, I got his ignite. I'm actually fine with that. What? Okay, I've got to be careful in the early game, but I'm actually okay with that, surprisingly. Eh. I'm kind of okay with that. I disrupted his early clear so he has one less box and I got Shaco Ignite so it ruins his early game gank potential. Yeah, I'm, I don't know, I'm not, yeah, I had to use Flash and I had to take Taunt level one, but I'm not upset. Bind. Oh, she had pull. Eh? <coughs> <coughs> Oh, again, apologies if I'm coughing and looking a little bit ill. The reason for it is because I feel a little bit ill. Uh, um, so, yeah. He'll go for the crab. Again, if he comes for me in the early game, I don't even think they can kill me. Because, one, I do have taunt, so I have my mobility to get away. Um, and he doesn't have ignite. And this is slow pushing into me, so I'll be able to free farm. I don't know. 
That might have been okay. It does put me behind in lane, so that's obviously not good, but yeah. Oh, it's a grassy and dying gangplank. I don't like grasp on him. There's no overlay on the abilities on map. I know. We got rid of that like ages ago. Got rid of that like, what, six months ago? Maybe more? Uh, you would be upset when you get camped. Hell no, I'd be happy if I get camped. I'm a Shen. I want to get camped. Do you, I, like, I want to get camped over my Morgana or my bot lane. Hell yeah. That's a good thing for my team, not a bad thing. It'll be annoying, sure, but that's a good thing. Okay, I'm... Again, whenever you see someone like that, to me, that's what I would call AFK baiting. That they're basically pretending to be AFK, so you go on them thinking you're going to get them for free. And sometimes it could mean that the jungler is right there waiting and stuff. Uh, obviously, now we know he's not, but he could be on his way here. Now. Alright. I purposely, by the way, didn't use teleport in uh, the when I came back to lane, because ah, I knew we'd probably get poked down a bit. But on farm-wise, we're actually kind of back to being even on farm. It's just XP that we need to catch up on now. Shaco could come top lane. Again, we counter a Shaco. Um, if he goes for a backstab with my W if I'm quick enough. Trying to make him go back. Wonder if he'll use teleport. He probably will. Sweet. I'm actually, I will say, happy that I went for that level one play. I hell yeah. I know it was a bit stupid of people go, "Huz, what the hell are you doing? Is that inting?" One, I, the, what, the reason why I went for it in the first place, by the way, is to get rid of a Shaco box. If you're like wondering, "Huz, why did you even go for that in the first place?" To get rid of a Shaco box. If you take away one of his boxes, it slows down his first clear significantly. So that's why I did it. But then also getting his Ignite, I, that's a big deal. Because Shaco, his advantage in 1v1 fighting in the early game is, I've also got Ignite, you don't. Um, I'm happy. Shaco hasn't done anything this game yet. Again, whether that's directly or whatever for me doing that, I, I don't know. It's basically impossible to answer. But... I'm happy. Because, again, it hasn't affected top lane that much. By the time we get this farm, we'll actually be kind of even. So I'm fine. Oh, that tower did too much damage. Uh, again, I didn't use teleport. He did. I did that on purpose. <sighs> if something could happen now and I could use ultimate... Because I kind of need to go back again pretty soon. But if I go back, I'd want to use teleport to come back to lane so I don't miss out. So if I could go teleport with ultimate, make a play happen, then teleport back to top lane, that would be ideal. <coughs> Apologies. Hmm. 
I don't feel well at all. Hopefully I'll be okay for Monday. <coughs> Ow. I, I don't really like the pool party gangplank myself. One, because, well, I don't really like it. And secondly, I think he just has a lot better skins. To me, you've always got to compare, like, what a, what skins a champion has. As well as, like, what they... Goodbye. Oh, my God. Uh, yeah, you've got to you've got to obviously look at what champion skins that they already had. Did Shaco go for that? What the hell? Um, and yeah, I just think Gangplank like Dread Nova is amazing. Um, I even like the old fashioned Captain. I don't know. It just doesn't stand out to me at all. That he got that off? Are you serious? Well, that's annoying. Yeah, plant, plant, plant. There's none of them there. So he's gonna gone cull. I actually agree. That's probably a good pickup. Like I probably could buy cull as well, to be honest. This is what this lane is. Farm. Farm with occasionally poke. God, I've, I kind of feel sorry for that Jin, but I kind of don't because he, he, the Jin's like it's a legit lane. It's not like he's against like an AP mage, like one of those weird lanes. He's against like a Zyra Misfortune, so it's a normal lane, and they're just getting beat. Ow. Oh, me and him were on a different page, I guess. I wanted to go for it. He backed off. Just solo cute things. Ah, uh, he did. Expecting Shaco bot lane. <coughs> That's where Shaco is. Yeah, in the Twitch chat, if you if you only watch on YouTube, we have um, a high, a a bot, a stay hydrated bot. I didn't put it in there. I don't know who did. I don't know if one of my mods did or something. But basically, it's a little bot that says like directly, "You've been live streaming for two hours. Make sure you're drinking." Basically, it gives you reminders, which is I think is a very good thing. Um, because again, when you're streaming and you're zoned in and stuff, it's very easy to forget just the basics. Of like, hey, go drink, go eat, go to the toilet. Um, I know that sounds weird to a lot of people, but I'm sure you've all had it in gaming sessions before. So yeah, it's good. I don't know who did it, but yeah, like it, it could be a thing that like uh, people just did because <clears throat> of like the heat, and they were like, oh, let's just put this bot in people's Twitch channels. You can disable it if you want to, but I, I like I don't think it's official. I don't think it's by Twitch. Hello. Alright, I kind of need that to push into my territory. <coughs> oh wait, no one's died yet on my team, by the way. It's 5-0. Snap, son. Wait, it's only 11 minutes. Oh my god, it feels so much longer than 11 minutes. It just randomly shows up in streams. Yeah, that's what I thought. I think I thought that's what happens. It just shows up and you can disable it if you don't want it. I was about to ult because I saw Miss Fortune's health going low. And then I saw the first death. I was like, oh, oh, they don't need me. But that, that again, that could have been two assists for me. I didn't need to do it, but it could have been two assists. That would have been nice. So I'm pretty sure this is basically a free win. 
Considering, again, if you're watching this on YouTube, if it does make it to YouTube, I had a game last game that wasn't. It was the opposite. We had a, an Aatrox mid that was feeding, and we had, a, I think, a 0 6 or 0 5 misfortune in the bot lane. Um, so it is welcomed, a nice free win, to be honest. I wanted to keep him here because I thought they were going to keep pushing in, bot in top lane, but nope. Ah, uh, he knows. I can't remember if this dude's a Shaco player, but I'm happy. Oh, snap. This is not good for us. No! There's just four people in the bot lane. Close. Morgana did go quite alone, but I guess she thought, like, oh, Shen will ult me, which is true. But, yeah. Damn. Those are the first deaths. Poop. I'm going to teleport. I'm bored. Should have bought a cold, to be honest. Yeah, I'm aware. I didn't buy Hydra that early because of the Gangplank matchup, but I do need a Tiamat at least. My pushing is too slow. That'll be my next buy, though. I really like this skin, man. It's nice. Hopefully they don't get caught without me, because uh, I can't ult them or anything. But I think they'll be okay. Zyra used ultimate and Misfortune didn't. So they've still got a Misfortune ult. There's that one. Trundle? Okay. Um. Okay. Trundle went a little bit balls deep. I'm guessing Gangplank is going to go mid, so I'm going to stay bot lane. Oh man, I know. I mean, I don't mean to be complaining, but every now and then I just get this rush, and I feel like I'm about to pass out. And then it like it only lasts about a second, and then I'm okay. Oh, that's not good. Oops. <clears throat> Again, I'm not fully paying attention. Uh. No more games for me. <coughs> Shaco's on that. Go check it. Shaco is on it. Or not. <laughs> Ah, uh, it wasn't that good. <laughs> I was like, he's on it! And there's none. Nope. Alrighty then. Oh, there he is. <sighs> I 
probably should have actually stayed bot lane now that I think of it. Hmm. I don't know. <coughs> Constantly looking, because again, the likelihood of Shaco trying to stop the misfortune is high. Thanks very much, Smoozy. Welcome, man. God, do you guys see that auto attack damage? Hehe. <laughs> there has to be Shaco going for her, right? Oh, that positioning. What happened then? I don't know. Oh, I do not know what happened. They're saying misfortune. Um, Morgana did something. Oh, is that the person who went behind here? Did she like tower dive behind without Zonya? Is that what happened? Possibly. I don't know. Maybe. Wait, I don't even have boots. Oh my god, my mind is just mush. Here's a PSA to everybody. Do not play when you're feeling like garbage. Like ill. God, what? I guess I'll go bot lane. <coughs> hmm, Trundle's got quite a lot of gold. Gameplank's coming bot lane. Oh snap. Oh snap. He's so quick. <laughs> <coughs> okay, we got it. Wow. It was a good shake uh, taunt on Shaco because the the moment that he showed, I got the nice taunt, which stopped him. Um, we've got two ways to get in here, so we're gonna be able to get probably two inhibitors. Actually, I don't think the enemy team can stop us. Or not, well, we should be able to get at least one. Oh, apparently they stopped. Oh, we're not even going to get one? Oh, that's not good. We probably needed to get at least one there. Mm. 
gonna go this again. We're basically playing more or less split push Shen this game, with a ca with occasional grouping. Um, so Zerot Portal, I don't think will be a miss. But yeah, this is definitely my last game for today. I'm feeling ill. I will probably have a um, yeah, probably well, well, I don't want to be too graphic, but I'll probably throw up after the stream. I'm good. I can just feel it, and I'm just gonna chill for the rest of the day, pretty much. Um, I could really do with a, a new game to play. Um, I like the the theme hospital game is coming out in the end of August. We'll be doing a playthrough on that on the second channel. I really wish that was out now. That is what I could like 100% that type of game I would love to play right now. Play WoW. I am actually tempted to play WoW and try to do my class mount um, for my hunter because I'm maining hunter next expansion. And I don't have that really cool looking wolf flying mount. I'm like, whoa. So I probably should try and get that. There you go. <coughs> play The Last of Us. Should I play that? I was actually I I got my PlayStation 4 pro, la, 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 la. I got my PlayStation 4 Pro set up the other day cuz I I I had a PlayStation 4 and when I was playing uh, Detroit Become Human and God of War in some of the bigger scenes it just, it did, it froze for like a millisecond and I'm a perfectionist so I didn't like that and of course Amazon Prime Day it was on sale so I was like oh I'll get it on Prime Day So I've got that set up now I I think I might play The Last of Us I'll just download, like, I'll yeah, I'll just digital download it. It'll be on the PS4 store, right? And then maybe I'll try to set up my Elgato capture card. Because, um, like, even if I don't do the Last of Us stream or something like that, I could, I could do a Spider-Man. Because I'm really looking forward to the new Spider-Man game. Is Last of Us the one about the, the daughter and the dad? Oh, your positioning. Oh. <coughs> Shake over here. Again, like, where else is he going to be? Okay, he's at the base. Uh... Wait, what? What is she doing there? This game's getting messy. I've already done Detroit Become Human. I technically could play through it again. Because um, I've not done, obviously, a playthrough on my new PlayStation 4 Pro. And I didn't, I didn't transfer any of the saves to the new PS4. Um... What I think I'm going to play today instead, though, is uh, I love the UFC game. And obviously, I had a UFC champion in that uh, on my old PS4. Obviously, I don't have that anymore, so I'm going to have to do a whole new P um, UFC playthrough. That's the fake one. How? I was CC'd for a really long time. I guess I got Shaco feared and Jin W'd at the same time. Oh, wow, he's got 2.6k gold. Snap. I do have Zerot Pool. How oh, we got Ohm Wrecker and Zerot Pool. <laughs> God, I haven't seen an Ohm Wrecker get picked in a long time. Ohm Wrecker's in the same friend group as Mini Lad and them lot who I'm playing with on Monday. And again, that item is actually named after him. I don't think he plays League anymore, but he was a he was one of the bigger 
content creators when League first came out. That's why he's got an item named after him. The WoW pre-patch is really fun. I've heard they've not put anything in. I'm waiting for them to input stuff and then I'll play. Alright, I'll go bot lane because I've got Zerot Portal and um, ult. So he's got QSS. They're looking for a pick. They should just do Baron. Yeah, I've also heard they've mucked up the scaling really badly too. Alright, they have to send Gangplank to deal with me. And Gangplank can't stop me basing. Uh, ulting. He can do damage to me, but... Means he's not going to be there. So you're coming for me instead of the Baron. Okay, well, that was worth. <laughs> Thanks. That's literally perfect. That's why I went bot lane. Didn't want to die, but... Just checking. Shaco's still behind. Okay, I've opened the base here. Shaco is just walking away. Doesn't seem like a great Shaco player. Again, we might, we may have tilted him from what we did at level one. It's possible. <coughs> Zyra's just having fun. And Zyra killed him. Stand behind me when you're not strong. I'll be your friend. Somebody. So a pretty boring game for me, but we won it. We we did some good things, and again, I was feeling really rough this game. So I don't know. I don't know if this is gonna make it as a video. It might. It might not. Um, because the events on Monday, I might have tomorrow off. If you know, yesterday I was ill. I'm feeling ill. Today I'm feeling ill. I'm probably going to be ill. And the event's on Monday. Today's Saturday. So I might have... Um, I might have tomorrow off. Alright. We gain 16. 146. We gain A minus. And the damage done. Doing no damage. <laughs> Yay. I don't know. That was a bit of a weird game. Um, I'll take it. <laughs> Why not? Uh, I'd say the level one was good, taking an extra box away from Shaco, taking his ignite early, and also the Baron play when I went bottom Baron, and then there's there were, what three people went on me, including their Shaco, and we got Baron for free. That was good too, I guess. But yeah, that's gonna be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, throw a like on it, subscribe if you haven't. Oh, and I'll see you guys next time.